Cutting corners literally can mean saving money. In these tough economic times, some people are clipping more coupons to pinch their pennies. In this KHQA Safe Family Consumer Report, Melissa Shriver introduces you to one tri-state woman who uses her coupon clipping talents to help a good cause. Joyce Sims is what you could call a coupon cutting extraordinaire. And in this economy, she says every little bit adds up. She admits it's always great to get a steal of a deal and perhaps help others while helping yourself. Well, you just kind of get a bit of adrenaline rush. It's like, look what I saved. <laughs> Find the local sales and coupons. Then it's time to go online. Websites like this one highlight the latest coupons. Sim says the way to save the most money is to search the sale items in your local stores on these websites to find extra coupons, and that can make a sale item even cheaper. This makes it really easy. It makes it a lot more fun, and you find things that you didn't even know were available. Sim says she saves about $500 a year doing it. Another key to a successful shopping trip is organization. Sims uses this book with plastic organization sheets to sort and store coupons based on the food group and grocery list. Then it's off to one of her favorite places to save a bundle, the CVS Pharmacy in McCutcheon. She can earn store credit coupons that can be spent like cash, and that savings adds up. I did really well. My first cart, I saved $26, and on this cart, I spent $3, and I saved $6. $63.63. Now these items are headed to a local women's shelter. Sim says it's a great way to give to a worthy cause while not spending a lot of green. Melissa Schreiber, K